Montserrat on the 10 meter platform, starting out with another forward three and a half somersault. That run to the end, vault up, spin around three and a half times. Oh, they slap the water, and that's because the divers know that the way to go in without making much, and then push them out of the way as you swim your entry. 56-55 on that dive for Luco. And on to Lavana. Just off the podium last year, finished fourth. And she's been in every final. Both springboards, the one meter, the three meter, and now the 10 meter platform final. It's a tough week. You've got to get in and out and in and out. You practice, you dive in the prelims, you dive in the finals. Not unlike swimming. But it's a different, includes artistry. Swimming, maybe not quite as much artistry. Two SEC championships. Trying to get on the podium for the first time. 50 points. This round and two more to go. Well, she's in the lead for now with two divers to go here in round three. And here's Lavanat, who is tied for third after a, a couple of dives. Degree of difficulty here, Cynthia, 3.2. Four tenths higher than what we just saw Tanisha Luco do. So she has the advantage, and she only needs sixes. Two more. Oh, big numbers. Because she keeps her feet together, and there's a lot of Cynthia, beautiful. seven and a halfs, all the way up to one judge, eight and a half. After three dives, Montserrat Lavanat out of Tijuana, Mexico. Her lead is around 19 points and off of the five meter this time with a 3.0 degree of difficulty. Yeah, this is big and her coach Drew Livingston, who's in his first year at LSU, was at Virginia. And now at LSU told me he thinks she's the most consistent diver. Oh, he hasn't missed like that. Throughout this contest in round four of five, she's opening the enough ahead that she really didn't have to do one of her best dives. She might be a senior, but she's got another year of eligibility. So that opens it up now for Montserrat Lavana, the junior from LSU, who was second behind Luco. And remember, Drew Livingston thinks that she might be the most consistent diver in this contest. He's in his first year at LSU. She's made all three finals. She's an athlete and she's a competitor. And Lavanat leads Kendall Knight by a little more than two points. So it's really head to head, these final dives for the SEC championship. And this young woman has two tenths degree of difficulty over Kendall Knight who follows her. Oh, cleaner going into the water, a little bit less splash. It would have been in the eight category and above, which is a big payoff. Kendall Knight and her final dive at 3.0 degree of difficulty. There are the numbers, 68.80 on Lavanon's final dive. Gives her a total of 293.50, which means Kendall Knight 